Hello guys, it is me Joe and welcome to my Wii U menu. What I'm going to do today is I'm going to be playing a game that I have never played before. It is called Runner 2 Future Legend of Rhythm Alien. Now I just saw this on my Wii menu today because, well, my brother just buys random stuff and I just saw this today as I said. And just before I even like, get off doing anything, sorry if my capture card starts doing weird stuff like as in just little picture glitches. I don't know why it does that. Today's Hopefully it won't be doing that too much. And <laughs> what is going on? So I don't know if my brother's actually played this yet or not. I'm just going to assume that he has. I don't know why I would assume that, but this is the Runner 2 Future Legend of Rhythm Alien. I will probably just play a little bit, maybe like a level or two, I don't know. This game uses an autosave feature when you see this icon. Do not turn off the console or remove any storage devices. I will not. <laughs> so when what is this? Mender video, his courageous contingent of charismatic compatriots was in hot pursuit um, of the fiendish <laughs> Timbletot as they chased him into a realm above realms called the hypersphere. <laughs> is this it like is a cutscene, or is this like the introduction? I have no idea. Fusion beam blindsides these five fearless friends. Um, I see some black dude being hit with lasers. Is that a thing? Oh, that's cool. Is like all rainbow or something. So light, matter, and PM, AM, FM. What is happening? I'm in jail. Oh no. Question marks. Now I'm pondering something, apparently. The only According thing to the game, to him now is that he has fallen prey to a vulgar scheme full of villainy, which he must. Um. <laughs> okay, so starter game leaderboards, the rewards, stats, and the helps help and options. I am going to go for the help and options because I am confused. So, um, how to play? Let's see how this works. Cross the finish line. Don't bonk. Um, don't bonk. Okay, press R to go to the next, which I will do. Okay, grab a treasure chest, play dress up, get an outfit, find new friends. How is this exactly how to play? Reveal hidden keys by beating key vaults. Collect retro game cart cartridges to play a retro challenge. Okay, this is all really weird and I don't know anything. Like I said for like the billionth time. Okay, ZR dances, um, the control stick, what, trace, loop, jump, kick, spring, yeah, spring, slide, and block. So those don't seem too hard. There's something on my screen. Okay, there. So, let's go back and actually start a game. See how this actually goes. So, Welkin Wonderland. Is that even how you pronounce this? I'm oh, not Welkin sure. Wonderland. Yes, it is. So, it looks like my brother has done a couple levels, but I believe this is the first world. At least I didn't see where it said what world this was or whatever, if, if there even is, like, different worlds. But Runner 2, I have no idea what kind of game this is, so... I'm going to be in for a little treat when I actually see. Okay, we have a little cloud dude. We have clouds blowing on us. We have us landing in clouds. We have mountains with phases. Because why not, you know? Okay, the Wonderland. We are the Wonderland. The What? The Wonderland. Yeah, let's go with that. So this looks very interesting. I like how it looks. Okay, press B to jump. I will jump. Okay, I've jumped. Okay, enemies. Oh, so it's one of these games where you're just running automatically and you just jump and do random stuff. And there is a really creepy looking mountain or hill in the background, whatever that even is. That reminds me of something, but I don't remember what it's called and that is very creepy. If I do say so. Okay, checkpoints. This is a checkpoint. 
And I think these are gold bars, which that's weird. And this looks like health. At least that's what it looks like. Like in every other game, that's what the health looks like. But this is like 3D stuff. Like the health just looks like 3D. And I'm noticing that if you hold the B button, he actually like does a little floating thing. I don't know if that's just my imagination or if he's actually floating. Let's see. Um, yeah, he's actually floating. So, is that the end? Yeah, this is the end. And what is happening? I'm going inside of a cannon. Okay, bonus challenge or chance. I assume I just press B, but... Okay, I, I failed that miserably. <laughs> I'm not really good at those kinds of things. Okay, so 32 out of 4, it looks like we kind of did perfect. But, let's go to the next one that says plain weather. I get it, plain weather. Is this going to have, like, planes in it? Because it's spelled P... Never mind. I'm not even going to explain that. I don't feel like it. So these enemies are weird. They don't seem like they attack you, and I've already missed a gold piece. Well, golden bars, there's several of them. This seems like... Like, this seems like it would actually be a fun game, but it seems boring. Like, for the first couple of levels, but... I assume they're going to, like, slowly introduce stuff. But we're already at the checkpoint, so... Like, I don't know if it's just this world, but the levels seem, like, very short. It's so, like, I don't know if this is a very short game, or if that's just how the first levels are. But I really like this game, if not for the fact that the hills look really creepy. Don't like that at all. They're just plain creepy. I don't know why they made that a thing. But oh well. You're not looking at those that much anyway, you gotta focus on the game. Okay, so did I win? I think I won. Yeah. <laughs> Level completed. 39 out of 40. Oh no. Did I not get to try that challenge thing because I didn't get... Um, 40? That must be it. So, I'm gonna do this level, see what they actually... Like, if anything gets... Wait, what? Oh, hold B to glide. That looks like Clyde, but it's a G. I think that's a G. Okay, hold B. So now they're actually introducing us on how to do certain things. This might be just like a single video. I don't even know if this is going to become a thing. Hopefully not, because this game, it's like one of those weird games. I have no idea, like, what to even think about this game. It seems easy, but then again, I'm only at like the first couple of levels right here. And I already missed, like in the last level, I missed one, so it's like, it's not... Like, I say it's easy, but yet I missed something. Like... Yeah, that's exactly what I would do. Oh, I missed that. Looks like I had to glide more. That's too bad. So I'm assuming that you have to get all those golden bars to go for the cannon challenge or whatever. And maybe I'm right, maybe I'm wrong. I have no idea. So that's that. Level completed, we got 38 out of 4. That's pretty decent. So that's going to be it for this, guys. Hope you actually enjoyed this whatever video this is. And I will resume Paper Mario or Donkey Kong Country Returns. Probably Donkey Kong Country because I think I've already uploaded a decent amount of Paper Mario so far. So I will be going to DKCR, but that will be in the next video. So, take care and goodbye everyone.